All right, this game chat, we're gonna pick another person to spectate again. Let's spectate Wanted. I wanna spectate Wanted. So Wanted's gonna play Sojourn again. Interesting, interesting. Oh, look at this. Look at this chat. It's Rush. Rush versus, uh, I would call this Poke, more or less. Oh no, never mind. It's Brawl v Brawl, but with mercy. No, no, wait, wait, what? Dude, their whole comp just so, wait, their comp just fell apart. What the hell? <laughs> Oh my god, Bowie just sends it and dies. Dude, Bowie, hello? Bowie just goes and holds W and just dies. <laughs> Bye, Fitzy. Fitzy's just opts to, to jump off. Doesn't want to feed any ult charge. Again, we talked about this before. Fitzy's a bit of a five head. Doesn't like to give any unnecessary ult charge. Oh, what? It gets diffed. Doesn't get around the corner. They have to burn res early. Oh, Wanta gets his revenge. I love how I love how he had like three easy shots there, and he decided, no, this, I'm getting revenge. It's, they can tell that's a very much a DPS player thing to do. It's if you get kind of diffed like that, you have to get revenge to get back on like an even playing field. Bowie though is kind of dominating up front now. Bowie may have fed his absolute brains out the first fight, but. On this point, with their comp, just the Rhine pick is pretty decent here, with how much support Bowie has. But, again, not enough to get a kill. Want wanted? Hello? Oh my... Uh-oh. Uh-oh. This is where Wanted's gonna start to shine a little bit and get sticky-nated. Not the sticky-nade. Oh my god, the cheesy sticky-nade. I actually thought he was gonna survive. Cause he had nano and it was like a, on, you know, Cole, it, 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 a it does like 140 or 141, but I think he had like 100 and like three health or some shit, but Ooh. damn dude, I'm actually surprised uh, it was Dead down, but, oh, I think ML just slept Quake back there. Thanks, yeah, look, at, you can see Quake's up on the high ground over there. Wanda just hits so many shots, like, oh my god, dude. I know it's a high noon, so like, it's not like that impressive, but like still though, yeah, Wanted just clicks. He just clicks heads. Look at it. I got slept, but I, I think that's probably the most exciting thing about watching Wanted is one. If you've ever not watched Wanted stream before, he's a very chill, very chill dude. He likes to just like vibe and take his time with stuff, and he's very calm. He's not someone who gets like loud and hype about stuff, but man, that dude can click. That dude can click heads. I think it's what I enjoy. I feel like if I was like a, if I was a DPS streamer, I think that's probably what I would be like. Oh, I mean, I had, if I had aim as well, but you, you kind of get what I meant. One is going to get run over here, though, if he does not leave. Oh my god, the solo May ult. Wait, Fitzy turns to his left, goes, shoom, throws the May ult, and then goes the other way. God damn, that was just rude. He actually solo ulted him. Yeah, I don't think that May ult got anybody else, but... Okay, real talk. I actually think that, uh, I don't think that Eevee's team can take this back. I think Wanted's team's gonna be in big trouble here. They only have Visor coming up. They have Nano soon, but I think this is a one and a half fight territory at this point. Uh, and that the Nano from ML side is gonna end up being a little bit stronger, a little bit more impactful. Unless there's an early pick by Wanted, this is gonna be tough. Oh, the big slam on a quake. Yep, and the nade follows up. They kill him. Yeah, I think this is. I think this is good night. They nano him. Yep. Oh, he ain't gonna slow down with the nano speed boost. Just not in their favor. It's tough running the doom. The doom. The doom comp. Like the way you play doom is, you have to have some like follow up like on it. You ha you can't have two like almost stationary dps you need like a sojourn or a tracer or something like that like there's n there's like like for all intents and purposes there is nothing for the doomfist to do like the doomfist pick does not work even though ryan is not very good on this point ryan's actually pretty decent which is why it was a smart call by ml to pick the fall but at even this point i think will probably be a little bit better for the doom pick because you can kind of like kite a little bit um but overall, though, it's going to be mostly, um, again, the, I think the Ryan comp being dominant. Because look at how far ahead Quake is right now. Oh, actually, ML and Bowie's team, dude, the, the ML, its team has decided to go the long way around. 
They're gonna play Ring Around the Rosie here, but they have Lucio speed and they have wall. Did they wall anybody? Did they catch someone? No, I don't think they did, but they were able to, to rotate quickly. Oh, Wanted almost dies. And there was a good anti there too. They're gaining on them. Like they really, they should not have been able to catch up to them this quickly, but they have. Oh, and Wanted falls for the wall. Unfortunate. That was a good, good trick play there. Wait, the res? The res comes out. Oh, he gets the pin off the res. That's that's fucking tough, dude. That's tough. Nobody's capped yet, by the way. Oh, we do not take this fight. Bowie, Bowie is uh, smells blood in the water, but like, man, dude, yes, that's a scary fight to take with people on all sides like that. So actually, interestingly enough, I'm surprised. Uh, Want to see him here? Actually, takes the point. Uh, and and this is actually where I think Bowie and ML's team starts to really get in trouble because that whole rotation thing is going to be a lot harder now because they have to force point as well as onto the enemy team. Oh, never mind. ML just gets a free kill. Oh, and then he goes straight for the res and gets the res, but they're just going to die. Okay. You know what? Oh, all right. All right. You know what? I think that was a little unnecessary. I, I don't... I don't... Wait, was it? I actually don't know how this fight is going. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. They actually clutched up. Get yourself together. Wait a minute. What happened to the the, uh, the second half of ML's team? I saw Bowie charged across after they got the kill, and they killed both supports. But did Arjun and uh, Arjun Quake just popped off? I dude, I missed it. I must have missed it. All right. Show's over now. They've now swapped under the, the Winston comp. They're the. This is this is where they go for the for the for the for the kill on it. So Bowie's just gonna be here trying to farm up Nano in a lot of ways. There's not really a whole lot he can do. He's just basically a Sojourn charge battery at this point. Oh, if he saved it a half a second longer, half a second longer would have had it for the headshot. Oh, Quake gets two. Railgun charged. Wow. What's the rush? That was actually that was actually big plays. I don't know what was going on with Quake's side right there, but uh, I think that uh, might have been a couple missed opportunities over. I don't. I wish I got to see it, but there was definitely a missed opportunity over on ML side. I don't know how they lost that fight before that. I actually have no clue. I didn't see it. Um, but wow, that, that was that was impressive. I do think the fun train stops here though, uh, because how do I put this lightly? This point is very good for Rush. So uh, unless Wanted's team plays this exceptionally well to poke them out, uh, Bowie's team basically can just force point on cooldown uh, and Maywall to buy extra time. They even might, if they run the sim as well, they basically are running the, we're gonna fight for a point comp. Okay, they decided not to run the sim. This is basically the fight for point comp. They might go top first to go for the wall. So they might wall right here, ready? Yep, walls them out. Buys them enough time to really get some space. ML gets the big nade, probably calls it out. Did Bowie get the kill there? No, I don't think they did, but they have Quake trapped. Thanks for the help. I think Quake got out, though. This is actually very dangerous for them to be doing is going this far out of the way, but I think it's they're going to be all right. Feeling better. Yeah, this is where they cap point, and this is where, this is where ML's team's comp is so strong. Look where Fitzy's hiding in that corner. Well, wall goes up. So Bowie's job is to basically sit here on this corner while the rest of ML's team kills the Doomfist. There it is. Pretty much textbook play, actually. This is how you used to be able to play this map all the time. You'd play the May comp and just sit on point and basically just hang out and wait. As the, the frontline tank, your job was to sit at the front and anything that got by you, like, really fast, like that Doomfist, you let it go. Keep the rest of his team from helping him, so... You'd have great positioning versus the rest of their team, and then their tank or whoever got through had terrible positioning in a 1v4. Or I guess in Overwatch 1 or 1v5. Oh my god, the shots from Fitzy! We get the res, though. 
So this is basically the way that Wanted's team wins this, is somebody needs to get on the other side. So like over the bridge, you know what I'm talking about? On the top over here. Like, I, you know, you can't, actually you can't tell what I'm talking about, but there's a bridge on the other side. Yes, where Wanted's going now, this side, boom. Someone needs to be flanking and someone needs to be like really pressuring their back line because if you just pressure from the front here, you just lose. The Rhine is too strong. And it's not because Ryan is OP, it's it's literally because this is the one thing Ryan is good at. Uh, no matter what, just from his design. They might flip this point off the dragon, though. The dragon is a, is a pretty strong ult on this point. Nice. Yeah, they flipped it. So, I wouldn't be surprised if you see um, ML's team here actually just hard engage point. As opposed to, uh, you know... As opposed to trying to take high ground. So here they go. Oh, Bowie leaving them ML out in the dark. Oh, God, left two. Let Bowie turn the f around. Jesus Christ, dude. I'm down, yeah, dude. Uh, dude, I'm mean, pressing charges, dude. How bad he just left them all behind. Oh, my. Dude, that was, oh, that was kind of dirty from Wanted capitalizing on that. But, man. <laughs> you can't help but feel a little bit for, uh, <laughs> for their back line. Enjoying the multiple headshots. So they're gonna actually go for top here. This is very interesting. I thought for sure they would try to force point. Oh, Wanted gets caught playing a little too aggressive on that door. I think the second you see them turn the corner, you kind of have to give space. Evie goes for the res, can't do it. Wanted, I mean, Warren is watching. Can't go for that. Yeah, and so actually the the pick on Wanted actually opens it up. Wanted playing a little bit too aggressive. That's kind of like Wanted's thing. I, see, I feel like Wanted always is playing like super aggressive. They swapped onto the Lucio Zen comp. This is interesting. So they swapped Lucio Zen to try to get away, I'm guessing, a little bit more. And they swapped to the Zen so they have a little bit more stopping power to follow up on kills with the Discord orb. Uh, you guys just... Hello? Did anyone just... Oh. They won. Okay, this is why Fitzy's kind of a five head. I, I see that they just walled out Bowie, and I'm like, hey, yo, hello? You just walled out your tank? What are you doing? But, uh... It was to win the game, so... I guess... I, I guess that works out. Smart play. I actually didn't see it. What was that? I've, ne I've never heard that voice line. What? What did he say? Like, special delivery, toaster, and doom? <laughs> like, what?